Hi, my name is Jane, and this is Lee, and we've just locked down in a shipping container on Spectra's AIM pipeline construction site. The purpose of us being here is to shut this down, end this project. Um, you can see uh, that we are prepared to be here for as long as it takes. We have our beds ready. Um, we have two weeks worth of food, um, books, and everything we need to live. Um, until uh, construction stops and Spectra goes away. Isn't a small sacrifice. I'm missing uh, my daughter's birthday, um, but I'm doing that this for her future and for other families. So it's worth it to me to make this my home for as long as it takes. Yeah, um, I am from Northern Virginia, but I have the I had the chance to work with people. Um, in Resist AIM, they came to D.C. to fight, um, to interrupt the Federal Energy Regulatory Commission, and I felt, um, you know, connected to them, and, and I've um, involved in f a fight against an LNG export terminal um, near where I live on the Chesapeake Bay. I mean, I kind of think of all of these infrastructure battles as one connected fight, and it's an honor to be taking up temporary residence in New York to help stop uh, the AIM pipeline. Uh, one of the things that um, has really driven me to take this action is knowing that this pipeline goes right by a nuclear plant on the Hudson, Indian Point. Um, it goes through school by schoolyards. It goes close to homes. It's a disaster waiting to happen. And it's driving us further and further away from a renewable energy future. Um, one of the very powerful elements of this action, I think, is the fact that this home is acting both as a form of resistance and um, as a display of, of the kind of renewable um, energy, sustainable future that we can build instead of going with Spectra's pipelines and the natural gas um, fossil fuel empire that is spreading out all over the place um, and so we have solar panels uh, on the roof that are powering batteries that we use that we'll use to charge our um, phones and um, provide us with light at night um, we also have a bike um, that will power a battery um, that we can use as well we also are uh, just doing basic simple things like warming water uh, with the sun uh, in the, pa the window panels on the roof um, so that we can take warm showers, uh, we can wash dishes, um, and then use that gray water uh, for other purposes like taking care of our plants. So every part of this home is really an example of the direction I think we all want to go in, not in the future, but now. Mm -hmm.